Thank you, Madam Speaker. Today, I rise for Stephanie from my district. This is her story. Stephanie and her husband were building their family. They had one beautiful daughter when she got pregnant for the second time, a planned and wanted pregnancy. But at 19 weeks, Stephanie got heartbreaking news. Her fetus had a devastating fatal birth defect. Based on her age, medical history, and test results, she was strongly advised to terminate the pregnancy. Stephanie ultimately decided not to carry the pregnancy to term. She told me through tears that her daughter needed her mother and it wasn't worth the risk. It's a profoundly difficult situation for any family, but it was their decision. HR 36 punishes women like Stephanie. It takes personal medical decisions out of families' hands and lets politicians decide. It also places a cruel burden on survivors of sexual assault and child abuse. It's unacceptable. On behalf of Stephanie, I urge my colleagues to vote no. We must stop the bans. The gentleman from Michigan Reserves, gentlelady from Georgia.